Hi folks, this is a homework problem that some of you have asked about uh, how to solve it using StatCrunch uh, to solve it faster than the manual method that the uh, text shows you how to do. Um, we can solve this uh, very quickly in StatCrunch. Uh, we have our raw data here. We can click on the little icon. I'm going to open that data in StatCrunch and we're going to do this in two steps. The first thing is to get a frequency distribution of the data. Now StatCrunch makes this very easy. We go to Stat Tables Frequency and we select our data which is in column variable 1. We can ignore the where and group by. All we want on this particular thing is the frequency so I'm just going to select that and um, leave the order by and optional uh, as they are and you click compute and we get our frequency distribution table uh, 12 in the first uh, bin 4 1 6 3's 4 4's 3 5's 3 6's 3 7's so that's the first part of the question and we can check that and see yes that is the answer they came up with 12 4 6 3 3 3 second thing is we want to construct a frequency histogram and compare that to the options we can use we've got our data in there so this time we just click on graph histogram select our column with the data again and this is a frequency distribution histogram as opposed to a relative frequency which you may see on some other problems but this one is the regular frequency um, since this is so simple we don't really have to put in the bins and the width of each of the the bins you may have to do that on some more complicated problems this one we can just leave everything else the same click on compute and we get a frequency distribution uh, histogram showing how those things are distributed and then we can compare if you look at the options here the one that I'm going to click on the expansion so we can see a little bit better um, 12 4 6 yeah so we match up that way so that's how fast you can solve this problem using uh, StatCrunch.